What's up, my beloved? You guys, guess what? I got in the building today with me. I got none other than Nappy. Hi, I am here. Yes, I'm so yes, excited. yes, yes. She's super <laughs> duper excited, y'all. She's ready yes. to taste the sauce. She got the mild version. She tasted the spicy, but it was too spicy for her, y'all. I did. Now, I had the spicy one. Remember when you came on my Yeah. Right. I had the spicy. My kids yeah. love the spicy, but I was like, <laughs> No, it's too hot no, for me. No, it's too hot for me. You know, I'm old. I got to... Yeah, tone it down. So we toned it down a lot. So I'm gonna, we're gonna say grace, and then we're gonna pick up one of these and do a thumbnail, okay? Uh, what's the thumbnail? I'll show you. Okay. <laughs> so let's bow our heads. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you for this food that we're about to receive. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 Okay. So you wanna grab one of these? Just grab. I'm gonna grab yeah, this one right here, one. and then what we do? And then I'm gonna grab this one. And you gotta look at that little circle right there. We're right there. Smile. Yeah, just look pretty. <laughs> smile. <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> okay, there you go. <laughs> you got it. That's yeah. it. That's it. Yeah. So now you know how to eat this? Give me one more with you looking at the lens. Me? Yes. Okay. She wasn't looking at the lens. Uh, she was looking up here. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the lens. <laughs> there you go. You got it. He got it? Yeah. All right. So, so what you do? I'm and about to, man. You can put, break it right here at the joint. At the joint? Yeah, you see how. Break it, bam! Yeah, and then you gonna cut it. You got some scissors over there. We gonna cut it both one up one way and up another way. What you mean? Okay, we cut that. Then Listen. you gonna cut this. Now, I'm not gonna oh, play see, with you. She ain't playing with me. See, I some of y'all ain't got. Y'all, I, I, I'm not about to play with you. <laughs> I'm so not. You gotta be like, but get them. Right? Man, let me tell you something. I'm not about to play with it. I've been waiting on this Listen, food. She is hungry, y'all. Yeah, I'm hungry. Shoot. She said, I ain't ate all day. I have not eaten all day just for this. Talk about, I'm about to. I'm not finna play with you. Y'all, you gonna see that? So I'm about to dip this in here. Like, yeah, and you? put you some lemon on it. Oh, I gotta put some. You gotta lemon have on. that lemon rain. <laughs> all right, like this here. Yeah, you dip it first and then put the lemon. I'm about to dip it Little and lemon. lemon. Dip it, lemon. Dip yeah, it, lemon. Yeah, lemon right. And then you just. All right, here we go. 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 Oh, here we go. Mm. Uh, oh my gosh. Mm mm. Mm mm. That's good. Mm mm. Y'all play too much. Mm mm. Yes, y'all do. <laughs> Mm. Mm hmm. Um. Mm. Wait. <laughs> wait. Mm mm. Wait. Can we cut this again? Can we cut this again? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cut it again, girl. I'm not gonna do this with you. <laughs> Nothing. B, I'm not gonna do this. Y'all, you know how long she been waiting it over here. Do, do you know how long I've been? Yeah. If you forget about me, baby. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Mm oh. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. <laughs> Wait a minute. Yo. You're find out what to eat. <laughs> I'm glad you ain't allergic to this stuff. You said what happened? Allergic. I'm glad you ain't allergic. No, I ain't allergic. No. To what? To good food? To Hell no. Good, I'm allergic to other <laughs> but not good stuff. I'm sorry. Yeah, but... <laughs> Look, she all... yeah, I'm I, told sorry. Her, I told her to watch her mouth because you know. I am. <laughs> it's hard, y'all. It's hard. We it's know. It's hard. We mm, know. Okay. We know. I'm about to I'm about to dip this egg in here though. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Okay. Y'all look at that nephew here in the barn. Her nephew hair is so cute. Her whole and, outfit. Mm. She got her whole outfit. She got her uh, stylist with her today. <laughs> she got her hair on point. Her outfit on point. Her makeup on point. I'm like, dang. She doing a big out here. He trying oh to Oh, my her. God. And let me tell you something. I told B. I said, B, love. I said, B. 
I don't know about this lobster stuff. Mm-hmm. Because the texture, I don't, it, it's, you know, like, I have a, I have a problem with oatmeal. You know, a lot of people. You don't like oatmeal? No. So you a texture girl? I don't like. Some people like um, tapioca pudding. I just ate a tapioca girl this morning. <laughs> oh. <laughs> tapioca. No. Oh my god. What is it? Is it the stuff that's in it? No, it's the texture of the. It's just smooth though. It's it ain't nothing. No, nah, they got them little beads right in yeah. it. So do you like rice? I love rice. How about what's that thing? Queen out quinoa. Cream of wheat? No, it's it's a quin. It's like a, a rice. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. Quinoa, queen, queen. No, I don't know what what you trying to say. It's like a little rice thing. Anyway, it's like a, a texture of grits. You like no, grits? I like grits. You but I will it? not eat oatmeal. That's weird. I will not. I will not eat oatmeal. Um, I don't like cream of wheat, and I'm I'm about to dip this egg. In Go here, ahead, though. girl. Give it the bit. Dip it. Mm-hmm. Mmm. -hmm. The egg is on point. Uh, Y'all know I love the eggs. That's one of my favorites. Let me tell you something. Boiled egg. Boiled egg. You can eat. Let me tell you something. You can eat boiled eggs mm -hmm. in the morning, mm -hmm. at night, mm -hmm. in the midday. <laughs> you can eat boiled eggs when you're hungry. Mm -hmm. mm. All day long. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, no, I don't like. I don't like the texture of food. Like, you I have these muscles. These are muscles. I can tell they're muscles. You wouldn't ever taste the muscle? Mm. Mm. Well, you probably taste it probably. You just like thought it was gross. Nah, man. <laughs> you don't know, y'all. Nah, man. Let me tell you. Mm, 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 mm. mm. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> y'all understand? I'm waiting. So long. I wait it up. Mm. Mm mm mm. Yeah. And I'm, and I'm, and I'm, and I'm, a, and I'm, <laughs> and I'm. <laughs> what did he to say? I'm like, what? And I'm, and I'm put the corn. Corn up? Mm hmm. Mm 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 mm. And I'm put the corn. In there. In there. Yes. Listen. I just, I love, love, love this. I love this. So I even see food, your favorite food. Yes, it is. It is? And rem yes. And remember, remember I, I asked you, I asked you, I said, you know, because cause I see you, you eat, um, you eat, um, Popeye's chicken. Mm -hmm. You eat, um, hamburgers. Uh-huh. And you, man, you eat it all, but I know, you, I, you, you keep I, your I eat, weight down. How, yeah, how? I don't eat a lot of burgers now. Because everybody, y'all know. And then, like, if I do eat mm. burgers, I eat a, a keto burgers, like, with the lettuce. What, what's that? With, with just lettuce, not the bun. So, you eat it with the, uh, the lettuce is the bun. So, you eat it without No, Nah, bread. man, I seen you eat a burger with the bun. Yes, yes, I do. But I don't eat bur uh, burgers a lot. Now, so I you do. don't eat the, you don't eat the, um... We don't eat the, the, you don't eat beef or turkey or, I mean, how, how does this work? I do. I eat beef. I eat turkey. I eat, but I just oh don't eat God. a lot of burgers. Oh my God, I don't understand. Can you pass me a napkin over there, please? But you put all your stuff on your napkin. Hey man, can you pass me one? <laughs> Thank you. Mm, mm, mm. No one, I'm thinking like, why is she ain't using her napkins? Yeah. Here's more. Mm, thank you. So, I'm, I, I said, Lord, if I just can just, all right, now <laughs> <coughs> I'm gonna try. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna try then. Oh Lord! You wanna try the? Yeah, I don't like the texture of it though. <laughs> it's not funny. So I one one time. Yeah, do this one. No, I already picked this up. So you gonna it, it split it in half right now? Man, y'all. <laughs> And okay, don't get me. It's, it's, the, it's the texture of. I had a very bad experience. You must have. Yeah, I did. I had a very bad. Cause that one is good. A very bad experience with. Um, and you said it was fishy. 
it was you know it was like rubbery mm -hmm. fishy but let me tell you something on today <laughs> Yes, I'm about to. What's up, my B loves? That's what she said. I'm about to mm. go in. Mm, mm. Okay, let me try. Mm. One, two, three. Is it bad? Mm. Mm -mm. You mm. don't like it? Oh. Mm. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Mm. Wait a minute. Mm -mm. Let me bust this mofo down. Wait a minute. Bust it down, huh? Hold up. It might be good. <laughs> she don't know y'all. <laughs> it can't be too bad because she's going to the second in. She's going in again. Yeah, this this might not be bad. My Hold God. Mmm. She probably had a bad experience. Sometimes it's no, like, I did. Mm -hmm. Like, I literally, um, and I'm not gonna say, you know, where I had the bad experience at, but yeah, it was like fishy, mm. um, rubbery, and I was like, dang, I ain't never eaten no another piece lobster. of lobster in my life. But on today. Today it changes. And yes, on today. <laughs> on today, I am. Mm -hmm. Ooh, ooh, this might be good. Mm -mm. Let me see. Let me try this one more time. Mm. <laughs> hold on. Mm. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. I got, I got some more. Wait for more time. I got some more. Mm. Wait a minute. Let me do this. Hold up. I stuck the shell in there. Let me suck this off. <laughs> she get down. Mm -mm -mm. She get down with the get down. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it ain't mm. bad. No, it's not. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's good meat. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm hmm. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. It's so well, huh? Father God and the Holy Spirit. <laughs> she said <you> God, y'all. <laughs> yes. I Ooh, love You this. know it's good. Yes, I love this. Thank you so much, You're for so welcome. Having me here. Yes. <laughs> so, mm. y'all, you know what, y'all? I know some of y'all may be familiar with Nappy. Nephew, what was you on? Um, what was your um nephew reality show? What, what did you have? No, 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 no. What the reality? What? I um I started that. You know what's crazy? I started with um Keisha Cole the way it is. Uh huh. Which you know that's my sister. Yeah. And then we went um three seasons in, and then we went to the Frankie and Nephew show. Right. That's what it was. Yeah. 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 And. You know what's crazy though? In real life, mm -hmm. people still love um, uh, Keisha Cole the way it is and the Frankie and Oh, yeah. It's a classic. They love it's a classic. it. Classic, yeah. And you know what they say to me? Even. Yo! <laughs> oh my God, I came with her. Oh, wow. This is a good piece of meat. It stopped her in her tracks. She stopped. <laughs> yeah, this is a this is a great piece of meat, girl. Huh? Knee bone. You done hit the jackpot. Oh, man, hold on, man. Let me do this. Let me say something about. Let me. Let me. Got dig dig. <laughs> she know how to eat. She been watching. She know how to eat it. Uh huh. That's what you said. <laughs> you said. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm she can't even talk, y'all. Y'all see how she's stumbling on her word like. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Them kids gonna be mad at you. <laughs> yeah. I can't even get my words out. Oh my god. That's good. <laughs> and I want you, that's how you that's how you taught us how you taught us how to eat this. Mm -hmm. Look. Yeah. She got the stuff dripping all down. She and this shit. Oh. It's dripping. 
My bad. Wait, wait. Mm. Ain't no apology on this show, girl. That's what happens. <clears throat> but yes. Mm -hmm. So you know, going going up, um, and you know, going from Keisha Cole the way it is mm -hmm. to um, Frankie and Nephi, and then over to Iyala Van Zandt. Why? Like I promise you, I watched that one too. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. How did you feel about that? Cause man, it was a lot of emotions. It was very emotional, you know, to watch you, um, um, and yeah, oh, Ayala, Ayala. Mm -hmm. yeah, and you was very upset, frustrated, trying to get your point across, and it was crazy. Well, even I, with the, I know, because I know she had you in the room, well, you know, by yourself, and, you know, and you and her talking one-on-one, -on -one and. Yeah, I think the, I think the most, um, I think the most hurtful thing was that, um, I, I could not get my point across the way that huh? I, <coughs> excuse me, the way I wanted to. Right, I know. So, you know, it was more so of let me talk. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Let me, you know, let me, let me, let me say something. Let me, but it's, it wasn't, it wasn't like. I couldn't say nothing. It was because, you know, because the other entity, which, you know, I'm now, you know, divorced. Mm -hmm. I've been divorced um, three years. Mm -hmm. You know, I went through a, a, a very trying time, a very traumatic time mm -hmm. with, you know, not just with working in the television um, industry. I went through a trying time personally, and people on the outside, you know, for for somebody to call you a gutter snipe or oh, tell me, <laughs> why, why you looking at me like that, Debbie? She said I'm a gutter snipe. What's that? It's a um a a dis a disrespectful child that. That's straight up out the like. If I, if I could pull get a phone, I would. <coughs> excuse me, I would Google that. Oh wow! I look, I looked that up. I've never heard of that. Yeah, I was called a gutter snipe, and people railroaded me for that. They were like, what? "Yeah, I got railroaded for that." Wow, that's crazy. Um. I, I went there mm -hmm. to, like, reevaluate my life, mm -hmm. save my marriage, mm -hmm. and um, it didn't work out that way. Wow. So, the, the, where you at in your life now, are you happier? Um... I'm learning me. It's and, you know. I don't know if I can she, make it through this. She having all types of moments, y'all, on this video. <laughs> I don't know if I can make it through this. I know. But um, I'm learning me. I just I'm a I'm a mother of five. Mm -hmm. I have a grandson that's three. Um, I just turned forty. Look good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And um you know, I went through I went through and I, oh man, okay, I, I gotta be very I went through a spell of learning my body. Mm -hmm. And it was hard because I did not know how to be alone. Mm -hmm. I didn't know what it felt like to not have somebody in your life. Mm -hmm. I I I you know I went, I, I lost, you know, three houses. Wow. Two cars. Um, I lost family. Um, I almost lost my mind. Mm -hmm. And wow. Yeah, I'm not gonna. We can change the subject. You know, I'm... 
almost, you know, lost me. Mm -hmm. But, you know, my children, um, they gave me all motivation and all. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> they gave me my sanity. And um, I, I was like, dang, man, I got to snap back. Yeah. You know, but then my supporters and my fans. Mm hmm It's like, you got this. Yeah. You can do this. You you got this because we're depending on you mm -hmm. to make this make sense for us. Mm -hmm. But I struggled. Wow. Big time. And... <clears throat> You ever have somebody, the crazy part is, when you have somebody that, I'm just using all the napkins. Nope. When you, when you have somebody um, walk up to you and say, you know, um, what you doing in Walmart? Or why you, what, you know, like, why you walking in Target? Like, you know, that kind of made me feel like it was abnormal. Mm -hmm. So like when you on the forefront and you're a public figure and you're a walking billboard. Mm -hmm. Right. Um, so it, this last past three years has been, you know, um, not necessarily a struggle, but an eye opener. Mm -hmm. And um, I thank God for it because I wouldn't be the strength that I am now or I wouldn't be the woman that I am right now and people would not be inboxing me and saying, I love you. Mm -hmm. I love your strength. Yeah. I love your stride. I love your motivation. Mm -hmm. I love you. And um, it was hard. It was, it was, it, and it's still hard, mm -hmm. you know, because... Everybody got to go through their process and they transition and, it's, and it makes it no better when, you know, you've already been on the forefront. Right. Mm-hmm. You got everybody watching you. And they're still yeah. watching me. Right. And they still, right. Yeah. 15, 20 years later. Mm-hmm. But when you don't understand that and you don't know how to operate in that form... Mm-hmm. But talk to me. Thank God for your kids. I mean, you know, your kids, like you said, that it really, really made you step up, you know, to be that woman and not be able to make, you know, make decisions that you shouldn't make, you know, as far as losing your mind or <clears throat> No, you know. and I'm telling you, <clears throat> mental health is important. Mm-hmm. Get making sure and you're in you are in this industry. Mm hmm Granted, you, you're in this industry in a different way, you know, with food and, 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 and the video. Like, for my children to say, oh, my God, Mama, oh, you're good. You know, mm -hmm. they knew that this morning. Mm -hmm. And I was like, okay. And I was like, we love her. <laughs> so, yeah. you have to understand to hear that, mm -hmm. you know, and then for somebody to be in my inbox and say, I love you because you're, you are a human being. Mm -hmm. And I'm sure you may have, you, you, you have to have some people oh, yeah. that say that to mm -hmm. you. Letters and gifts. Yeah. All that. Yeah. You know, and it's, 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 you know. Do you find to be a lot of pressure on you to be the woman that, you know what I'm saying? Every day is a pressure for you to be, because you know you're you. I know you're you. You're 100% you. Nappy is nappy. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's what we're going to get all day. That's okay. We'll get that later. But anyways, but do you find it to be, is it peer pressure? You have pressure on you, you know, to be, to keep yourself up, to be able to, you know, be a part and to, you know. 
in the public eye. Yeah, you know, and it's crazy because you know I'm I'm always called ghetto hood ratchet, mm -hmm. um, like. Does that bother you? Yeah, it's hurtful. Mm. What do you don't think they take you serious or what? No, well, I'm, I'm taking food too. I don't take me serious. Mm. Wow. I don't take me serious. But, you know, I'm going to keep pressing towards the mark and being exactly who I am. Nobody can take me away from me. Mm -hmm. um, <clears throat> and the greatest, the greatest, the greatest thing um, about being a public figure is being public. Mm -hmm. And people don't understand that. So, I have grown so much. Mm -hmm. And we have watched you grow so much. <laughs> <laughs> we have. We really have. Baby! <laughs> I know. Bye-bye. <laughs> I'm going to tell you, that zero to a thousand uh -huh. is real. <laughs> I know. I just take some moments, y'all. Oh, my we God. We all have. Listen, <laughs> and we having our moment, and we're and we having this great food, and we're having our moments, but let me tell you something. <laughs> to be able to sit in your space and your element and not lose your mental mm -hmm. <laughs> yes it's amazing mm -hmm. and you know I'm I'm like damn I'm 40 mm -hmm. I'm like I'm 40 I keep hearing that in my brain <laughs> Come on. 40. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But see, and when you was doing your uh, reality show, you was in your twenties, wasn't you? Yes. I was just like, wow. You are you are a household name. Seriously. Everybody know you from you know from because that's you you was doing reality when reality first hit the scene. We were doing reality before reality hit the right, scene. Right, that's what I'm saying. And we're still doing it. Right. It's like So we paved the way. Mm -hmm. And I'ma say it. Whether you want to hear yeah. it or not, we paved the way mm -hmm. for reality TV. Mm -hmm. We are the reason. We are the reason <laughs> why like y'all can do reality TV. Mm -hmm. We are the reasons why mm -hmm. y'all can be exactly who you are. And if anybody were to argue, hit me in my DM. Oh wow! <laughs> well, y'all heard that. Y'all heard that from Nippy. If you want to argue, it's the truth, y'all. No, that, if you want to argue with me about uh -huh. that, hit me in my DM. Mm -hmm. Hit me in my DM. Don't send me no Corona, cause I'm not doing no Corona <laughs> anything. <laughs> Don't send her that, y'all. But look, listen. Man. And and this, and you know what's crazy? What's crazy is. We started doing reality TV in 2006. Really? No, 2005. That's like what? 15? 2000. I might even say we start filming in 2004 to put produce in 2006. Mm hmm. Come on. Mm hmm. That's a long time. Some of these people, y'all, some of y'all want even more. I thought of. <laughs> yeah, that's a long time. So, <laughs> Keisha called the way it is, and the Frankie and Effie show paved the way to open up the doors for reality TV. Oh, wow. And if anybody want to argue with me, come on. Wow. Um. And it was it was a, a lot of people viewed into the, to them shows. I mean, y'all, I'm sure y'all, the views was out the off the chain. Cause I didn't even see that. I didn't see everything. 
every time it aired, I was I was like on my, I was glued to TV. Yeah, and then um, and then I don't want to. Okay, I don't necessarily want to say paved the way for reality TV, but paved the way for our kind of reality television. Right. Because people were already doing mm -hmm. shows, you know, but in our But world, you talking about family, like, yeah, okay, yeah, African Americans or whatever. Oh, you know, however you want to put it. Yeah, okay, yeah. 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 Cause you probably the first one that's put y'all fat like your real life out there. Like, here, we giving y'all all of us. You know, happy, sad, not getting along with this. I we love each other the next day. It that's what happens. Mm hmm You know? That's and To be able to come back mm -hmm. and still get the same response mm -hmm. is amazing. Wow. So everywhere you go, you get recognized. Period. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> like, period. <laughs> I know you do. I'm just like, man. Mm -hmm. So and you know what? The the cool interesting thing about interesting thing about it now is you doing um you have a podcast. Yeah, okay. Cause I know a lot of people don't know. I know you. A lot of y'all don't know, but she does have a podcast. Yes, wait a minute. Look, can I eat my egg? Sure, eat your egg, girl. Chew it on up. Mm -hmm. You ain't touch no more of this food. Well, but. you know what? Cause you got me most times when you get me emotional, I get emotional. I can't. It makes my appetite not so good. I don't. When you were that. talking, it does. I'm serious. Mm. I'm like that. I'm not. I'm. I'm just like that. I'm like okay. You got me a little. Shooken up <laughs> when you were talking. So I do, and you know, and I didn't think that I could do radio. Girl, uh, somebody you know absolutely told me that. Mm -hmm. Oh, you got your, you know, your little radio station and your little radio this, but um, oh. his um, his ninety two point three absolutely gave me an opportunity. Mm -hmm. hmm. To use my voice mm. granted it's only on Sundays mm -hmm. but I can still use my voice I can still um, try to change somebody's life one Sunday at a time mm -hmm. so how are you liking it do you like it you love what you do I love my job good um, sometimes I get, um, a little emotional because I have my guests that come on there that are, they come from all across the world, literally all across the world. And either they come to tell, to promote their business, their brand, or they come to tell a testimony. Mm -hmm. Most of them come to tell a testimony. Wow. Which is good, amazing. Most of them come and say, I'm here because of you. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, you're here because of me. And then they say, when are you coming back to television? And I'm like, oh my God. Yeah, we we'll love that. You think so? I, I love that. Oh, sure. Would you... <coughs> what are you thinking about that? What you think about that? Would you want to come back? Go back. <clears throat> um... The crazy part is I'm coming back. Oh! <laughs> oh, okay! <laughs> Boom! There you go! <laughs> uh, yes! If you didn't know! <laughs> okay, that's good. The crazy part is I'm coming back. Um, but... This, amazing. Yeah, this time... Um, what is the focus? They know Nephi. Okay. Everybody knows Nephi. Mm-hmm. But my name is Nefeteria Roche Pugh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. All right. So, Listen. I'm going to need y'all to know Nefeteria... Nefeteria, okay. Yes. Um, so I, I think for me this this time is not just a focus on me, but 
you know, they watch my children grow up mm -hmm. in television. I What's have, your oldest? She's 22. Yes, 22. And my grandson she, is three. She was a little baby. I mean, little, little old thing. All of them. Yes. yes. So, it's like, dang. So, and then, of course, Jalen. Jalen, we love Cole. Everybody. Mm. My son that was introduced to the world. Um, he's 12. Wow. So. Now, that's your youngest. No, my what's youngest your, your is youngest? 10. Okay, your youngest is 10. Wow. So I'm when I'm talking about Chris Star, I'm talking about Brianna, Chris Daria, Sierra, Jalen We Love, Nana Noel, and Tyler Moore, my grandson. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> between between all of them mm -hmm. and me and and, and and what they wanna like Brianna is getting ready to graduate from college in May. This May. She did. She wow. You gotta be proud. I know you proud of that. She's on the president's list and the dean's list. What? And, and she is um, one of the most influential um, African American women in uh, um, in Georgia State University. Wow. That that it was it was only five of them. One two three. I look up. One two three four five. It was only five of them. And she's um, the only African American one. That's amazing. I know that had to make you proud. <laughs> Girl, I've been chest and cheesing all day, like, yes. Yeah, That's so nice. to even be able to still use your voice, let me tell you something. Mo <laughs> yo, mo photo. <laughs> she is so damn <laughs> Let me tell you something. Yeah, okay. Let me tell you something. Okay. Let me tell you something. Let me talk to you real quick. Okay. <laughs> okay. Go ahead. To be able to be called ghetto, hood, good as ratchet, ratchet. <laughs> and no, not only that, ugly. Oh, honey. Oh, yeah. Ugly, dark skin. Mm -mm. Oh, you. Honey, I done be called everything that I am not. Right. But I am here. Yes. <laughs> you here. And you still get paid. And still and getting paid. And I'm a little go. good. You look good. great. Yes, you do. Okay. <laughs> yes, you do. Come closer. <laughs> I look good. Zoom in. Zoom in, <laughs> y'all. <laughs> she looks amazing. Yes. Amazing. So when I tell you. It's all about the testimony. It's all about the testimony. Mm -hmm. God takes you through your test for other people to see and value what they're not valuing. Mm -hmm. And it, 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 it's, it's not about your journey. Your journey is for somebody else. Of course, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's why they love you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah. Your journey is for somebody else. Mm -hmm. And you have the people on your show that you have. They were already chosen. Mm -hmm. yeah. Everybody can't go. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody ain't chosen, y'all. <laughs> it's true. Yeah. It's true. So, you, you know, you have to identify with that. But, oh, oh reality TV, I be... That's gonna be amazing. I'll be back. She's back. She's coming back, y'all. You know, I can't wait. Yes. I promise you, I'm tuning in. And my thing is, so my I think to, right now, today, to the time we living in, it's gonna be even more, you know, people are gonna receive even more because reality this is all we watch is reality. Reality is it right now. Back then it was like trying to, you know, come on scene and this and that, but I mean we're still doing this thing, but right now, air, you know, everybody What's your best soap opera? I don't even watch soap opera. No. It, it, your mama watched soap operas. The General Hospital? General Hospital. <laughs> the Bold and yes, the Beautiful. Yes, that's right. As the World Turns. As the World Turns. The Young yes. and the Restless. See, she, she bring it up. Ah, yes. Okay. <laughs> yes. The Young and the Restless. Mm -hmm. That was reality TV to their world. To, to, to that generation. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And it just yeah. recycled itself into something else. Real life.
Yes. Mm -hmm. Think yeah. about it. Mm -hmm. Because everybody could identify with all the soap operas. Yeah. Everybody could thing. yeah, everybody could even identify with Cheers. Mm-hmm. The Golden Girls. Oh yeah. Martin Lawrence. Mm-hmm. Good times, all Good of them time. people, the yes. facts of life. So, the whatever. facts of life. Yes. Everybody could identify with that. So television just recycled into this kind of generation. Mm -hmm. And I don't think we value it the way that we're supposed to. Mm -hmm. So, yes, use your platform to elevate, but remember who's watching you. Oh, right. Absolutely. Because you told me, oh, this is this is PG-13. Right, right, right. <laughs> Yeah. Listen, so, I want the parents to be like, oh, she, they can't watch you no more because you get, you know, <laughs> you know, I just, you know, it's, it, it is important that you said that because you do have to really present yourself different, you know, something differently, you know, for the, your audience. But so how do you feel about that, though? Because you have multiple guests, mm -hmm. multiple yeah, like, guests, mm -hmm. and each person is different. Each person's story is different. Is it? Yeah. Each person's testimony is different. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. How does that make you feel as an influencer? It makes me feel amazing because I, I like to hear the story. It helps me as a woman. If it helps me to grow or chat, you know, it, it makes me, you know, it helps me in different areas of my life. And it helps me to grow as a woman. And I sit and wonder, like, wow, this person has been through a lot. And for me, if it helps me, I know it's helping my audience. Like, you know, we looking at y'all like, because yeah. let me just tell you one thing. I just know that well, with a lot of celebrities, the thing that we do have in common, that we <clears> all <throat> are on social media, and we get hit with all types of trolls or people coming at us. How do you and, feel about that? Oh, girl. Because when you, you, because you told me your testimony mm -hmm. on the show, you was like, you know, I'm not doing this no more. I'm about to do this. Yeah. And as you started doing mm -hmm. this, what's the difference? It's important that you don't lose yourself. In this reality, you know, in, yeah. in social media, because people try to change you yeah. and try to tell you what you need to do or what they don't like about you and different things like that. And I've always been a woman that I'm going to do me regardless, unapologetically be myself. I'm not going to do what you want me to do. I'm going to be on my own agenda. I'm going to be on God's yeah. agenda and let God lead this thing because people want to judge you and half these people go. So let me ask you this. What happened when you got your first troll? Because baby, they be trolls. Girl, I just took that back. In the beginning, <laughs> I used to cry I'm for real. I, I knew but it. I did. And, but then it got too many. When I started growing, my videos started going viral, and it was too many to come up against. I just stepped back, and I literally have, you know, a girlfriend that, you know, yes. she's a therapist to me, and she just tell me, don't do that. It ain't, it ain't, it ain't worth your time. So I stopped. I started ignoring them. I just started living for myself. Yeah, you started realizing that. that they're not worth your whole entire absolutely. breath. Absolutely. Absolutely. And then I have a brand to protect. So I'm just like, I'm whatever. I'm still making money in my sleep. So it don't matter. <laughs> I be like, yeah. Yo, <laughs> let me tell yes, you. Yes. Let me tell you. <laughs> in your sleep in making your money. Sleep. In your sleep. So I, Let matter. me tell you, and I didn't realize that until I become an author. Really? I didn't even realize that I was making money in my sleep. Like, my book is still... Yes. I bought that book freaking 15 years ago. Mm -hmm. Damn, man. <laughs> I'm like, y'all still ordering my mm -hmm. happiness is my sanity? Mm -hmm. What? I still get... <laughs> I don't give a damn if it's $26. It's, it's a it's residual... Ex exactly. It's a residual... Check. Mm-hmm. Okay? Yes. <laughs> Boo. <laughs> she like, <laughs> Boo. Oh, <laughs> real. No, in real life. Yes. And I get a, I get an annual statement. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Baby, I said y'all better quit playing with me. Quit playing, y'all. Quit playing. <laughs> That's why it's our way. I love it. Yes. Listen, y'all better quit playing with me. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, so... For 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 me um, to see people transition like that, yeah, is amazing. Mm -hmm. You ain't gotta talk about what you make in your sleep, right? 
<laughs> you ain't got to talk about it. <laughs> you right. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. No. You ain't got to worry. Don't worry about what I make in my sleep. Mm -hmm. And don't even worry about who I sleep with. <laughs> right. <Okay. laughs> All of that. All yeah. of that. Yeah. So, you know, you, it, it's, 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 it's like a, a refreshing thing when you're not afraid to be exactly who you are. Exactly. Yes, it is so and good. people right. will take that away from you. Mm -hmm. Try to be yeah. If you let them. Yes. If you let them. Yeah. That's why you have to have thick skin in this game. You yeah, know. Girl, I know that. <laughs> you, I mean, it took me a while to get to the point. I'm like, oh, so I see how this work. Because in the beginning, you just, we human. You know what I'm saying? And I didn't know a lot about this. So I started three years ago. I didn't know about that social media thing. Because you've been doing this thing a long time. You a G. You know, I'm a, you an OG. I'm like, I'm, I'm learning. You know what I'm saying? I've learned a lot and I've grown as a woman on this platform because I'm like, wow, okay. Yeah, yeah. You gotta Let me watch eat your this circle. Corn, though. Go, boy. <laughs> you gotta watch your circle. Your circle gotta be tight. I'm telling you. It's like, you got your eye open. Like, one, one eye open. <laughs> that be like, girl, you ain't said nothing but a word. You know, she, I know mm. she know. Because mm, 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 mm. you don't know who's around you. <laughs> Mm mm, the corn. Put, <laughs> mm -mm. put cloud or whatever the case may be. I'm just like, oh wow, you are vicious. You know, girl, I know. <laughs> I'm telling you, yeah. I'm beginning to know. I'm like, wow, okay. They will. I see you. They will absolutely try to eat you alive. Mm hmm. And then talk about you like a dog. Now, how do you handle that? Cause you are. Everywhere you go, you like I said, you a household name. Everybody knows you. So how do you know? How can you know if somebody's there for you? For you? I don't you? have no friends. Oh, man. you just keep it. <laughs> so you just keep it like okay, cordial. Like, I don't you know, have no uh, friends. I right. got my children, mm -hmm. my grandson, and that one person. That one person. Man, I can count on my shit. Shoot. Okay, <laughs> my bad. That's okay. Yeah, I I, I feel you. For real, cause you don't know. And everybody ain't worth it. And everybody ain't worth your time. I don't give a damn. Everybody is not worth your time, mm -hmm. your effort, or your energy. Ener energy, energy is yes. everything. Yes, well, I'm always talking about my energy, protected at all costs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes, mm -hmm. y'all. Cause man, I'm <laughs> telling you. This been on this side can be lonely, you know. Sometimes, you know, for you know, inter people that's in social media, if you don't have a nice a core group of people that's really in your corner, everybody is first. click. Y'all clickish. <laughs> Stop being clickish. Mm -hmm. Y'all clickish, and y'all some haters. Yes, yeah, some of y'all. Y'all don't want nobody to win. I don't. Whoever watching, I, yeah, I said it. Somebody needs to say it. Y'all clickish and y'all some haters. And she's talking about some of y'all. Not all of y'all, but some of y'all is. Some of y'all is. <laughs> and some of me gonna eat this corn. <laughs> mm -hmm. But man, I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. But I'm sure that... Um, she wasn't hungry. I'm hungry. <laughs> she gonna take all this food home too to her babies. Yes, I am. Yes, they gonna I have am. a lot to eat. But in real life, you know... It, 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 it is a real true statement and it's so sad because we need a support system. No, oh, yeah, definitely. You got a two man team, you and your husband. Mm -hmm. Who gonna support him mm -hmm. when you are tired? Right. Yeah. Who you gonna trust to support him when you tired? Girl, exactly. <laughs> Listen, that's when I gotta get on my knees, Lord. Jesus. Exactly. I'm gonna ask that question again. Who mm -hmm. gonna support your husband when he tired? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because he's so busy running this <laughs> train. Mm -hmm. You the queen, but he the. Yeah. I mean, we both we both work hard, but the thing about it is, you still have to. Lift each other's arms up. Who on if one arm fall, you gotta keep that other arm up. You know what I'm saying? Like with Moses and stuff. So it's like, you, that's when you have to have God on your your side and you just gotta pray, Lord, give us the strength to be able to go on and keep this thing running and going. 
And how do you feel about that though? I, right now, I feel good about it. I'm just glad I'm at the age that I am and I'm able to move. I was just saying that about my health. I'm able to move and uh, y'all know I'll be everywhere. Traveling, I'm just yeah. able to do that and not, not on medications or doing, you know what I'm saying, not in the hospital. And I just got everything going, you know what I'm saying, my limbs and everything. So I'm appreciative of that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Did y'all hear that part? <laughs> Honey. Yes. This setup is real. So, and that's how... Um, that's really how my focus have been. Um, I struggled. When I say I struggled, I struggled. Damn near broke struggled. Mm -hmm. Just to keep my sanity. I didn't, Please. that's the one thing that you're not going to take away from me. Mm -hmm. Is my sanity. And... You know, it's hard when somebody, especially in this industry, when you are viewed through a lens or a camera, but that they're not the ones taking a picture, mm -hmm. nor they're not the ones that have the frame. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So how can you view or even analyze somebody and you have no view at all? You're not the one behind the camera. They're you're judging. not the mm -hmm. one behind. You're not the one taking this picture. Matter of fact, you're not the one painting this picture. Mm -hmm. This picture has already been painted mm -hmm. because God made me to God, be yeah, the story exactly yes. who I am from the crown of my head to the sole mm -hmm. of my feet. So He's the beginning and the end. Mm -hmm. So I, you know, when people get at me, I just be like, okay, you know what? Yeah. Call me ghetto, call me hood, call me ratchet, call me a gutter type. But what you what you didn't know is I'm very educated. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what you did not know. Mm -hmm. I've been somebody's wife twice. Mm -hmm. No baby daddies. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she like I'm the check y'all. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. What you did not know is. A lot of what's been going on, I paved the way for that to happen. Mm -hmm. And I'm not talking about, they're going to be like, oh, you paved the way for your sister. No. God planted her feet the way he planted her feet. Mm -hmm. And then she came and got us. And then we took what we did, what we needed to do. Mm -hmm. I paved the way for my children. To do what they're doing now. Family legacy, yeah. So, like, I'm sick of people talking about, you know, she ain't this, she ain't that, or look at her, or, uh, yeah, look at me. Keep, keep, thank you. You a walking testimony. That's what it is. Really. <laughs> anyway, y'all, because I thought, I'm, I'm waiting to see what you're going to bring us, because I know. It's, I mean, somebody has been t changed and touched by your life. You know what I'm saying? And the, all through all your experiences you've been through, I'm sure somebody has been like, wow, Nephi did it. And you, girl, you done went through all your whole, your life, your struggles and everything through, through television. We seen it. Yeah. And this and, is the outcome. Yeah, let this me tell you. Hey, hey. Looking good. <laughs> this is the outcome. If you know how to hold on, hold on to your sanity. Yeah. And looks. At hold you know on to your. My first book, My Happiness is My Sanity. Mm -hmm. My second book, The Price I Pay, Life After Reality TV. And I'm currently writing and working on my third book, Suffering in Silence. Oh, okay. So. There you go. I am excited. Not only that, you know, returning back to reality TV, but, you know, um, because my children are older and now I'm a grandmother, my strategy is different. Yeah. You have to move different. Okay. Yeah. So... I mean, you can't you can't go wrong with good food, <laughs> good content. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like you, yes, okay. <laughs> huh? You right? Do that, yes. <laughs> <laughs> y'all. And 
I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited about what God is doing in my life. And I even, I thank you for having me here because you didn't have to choose me. You didn't yeah. have to, you didn't have to. You know, girl, I'm going to have you on here. Yeah, you didn't have to. I was like, when I see, I said, Neppy, that's my girl. You crazy? <laughs> Is you crazy? And I, yeah, and I love it because you know, um, you give the chat, you give you you give your your followers and your viewers mm -hmm. a chance, not only a glimpse in your life, but mm -hmm. you give them a chance to follow and look into other people's yes. lives as well. So you. I Amazing, yeah, y'all. I know I'm gonna have you back. You gonna have me back? Oh yes, definitely. We gonna we gonna have her back, y'all. I'm coming back, y'all. She has a lot to share. Yes, yes I do. She does. Yes, she does. I'm not eating these muscles though. <laughs> we don't let the kids eat them. Yeah, I know I'm scared, man. You scared? I'm scared of the muscles and the clams. <laughs> Look, she no, told, they she said she told y'all lost the up though. Y'all did. No, that lobster was good. They said it's an aphrodisiac, right? The yeah, this the oysters. Talking about oysters. Oysters are muscles. Oh, this is not oysters? Mm -mm. What's These are muscles. No, I ain't eating them. <laughs> See, no, I ain't eating that. No, I'm going to try it, though. I'm going to try <laughs> with the sauce. I love you. Yes. Anyway, y'all, we have been talking. We're going to let y'all go. But, like I said, we're going to have her back later. Don't forget, I'm going to leave all her links down in the description box below her IG. Um, Thank also, you. What is it? The, uh, every Sunday you are on. Every Sunday, uh -huh. I am on His 92.3 from 5 to 6 p.m. And listen, y'all can be a guest on my show. Y'all heard that? What? DM her. Not, you, you can DM me. No, no, she, no, 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 no. You can't DM me. You can DM. <laughs> That's what she sound like me. No, 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 no. You can't DM me. You can DM Celeb Stylus 404. <laughs> DM him. Don't DM me. Why can't she go give me that information to yeah. the <laughs> She sounds like yeah. I was talking about that. Yeah, like, yeah. Right, right then. Next right. from Reality Radio each and every Sunday, 5 yes. to 6 p.m. on his 92.3. But I want you guys to pay attention to my new book that's coming out. I'm so excited to return back to reality TV. I am too. I think we all going. I yes. think we all going to be happy. Suffering about that. in Silence, my new book. Okay. Like this this one here. I'm trying to it's take. Gonna be it. I'm trying to take it. I'm trying to take this to Netflix. Man. Okay, Netflix. We try to get to be the number one seller. <laughs> yeah, no, and you know I've best never one. been a best. I got four out of five stars. Really? On both my books, and did not make it this, to New this York. This will be the third time it's a charm, girl. It's yeah, I didn't make it to New York's bestseller. I was like, we gonna get her there, y'all. We gonna get her there this time. Yeah. <laughs> She made this. She earned it. She's earned Man, it. I'm telling you. I paid my dues. She did. She did. She absolutely <laughs> have. She absolutely have. Yeah. So I I love this. Like I love this. I'm about energy, and I thank you so much for having me. Yes, so much. We love, be loved. I'm taking all this food. I know home, she is. I'm gonna pack it up for. Her. But y'all, <laughs> on that note, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with anyone, everyone. Let me know what your girls doing the channel, and I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. I love you guys so 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 much. Don't forget to stay safe, stay, stay blessed. Peace out. Peace, love, hair. Peace, peace and love and happiness. <laughs> Make sure you like, share, and subscribe.